Science is a series of educated risks. Every scientist knows that. Science is never wrong, and yet you put us at risk. There's nowhere to run to. Science is never wrong. Yeah, science is never wrong, but you are. Science is never wrong. What if it is? I hope to God we're wrong. Our results tell us that the Earth's polarity is going to shift. Well, now. It's happening, isn't it? The polls are flipping and you knew about it all along. You know, we can legally bind you from publishing. Publishing? I'm not gonna publish. I'm gonna buy a summer home in Alaska and store up in a shitload of canned goods. The research team was evacuated due to an unusual event. 30 degree temperature spike. Oh, damn. That's cold. Spike means up. Global warming? Yeah, but what would a giant block of ice be doing underneath Miami? Well, I'm not saying there is. I'm just floating a theory for discussion. Boaters and fishermen were greeted this morning by a most surprising and unwelcome visitor. No one expected a genuine, bona fide iceberg to block the harbor entrance. And remarkably, no one knew it was coming. Oceanographers at the University Marine Center are stunned by its sudden and unprecedented appearance. Somebody told me that the poles were melting so fast they were actually changing the shape of the Earth. That's one of the theories that causes polar shift. You change the shape of the Earth and that's enough to knock it off its axis. And there's a Mayan legend about a day that the sun rose and suddenly at noon turned black. An eclipse. One would think. But when the sun returned, a thousand years of darkness followed. No, Philip, it's not alien DNA. What it is is scrapings from a cave painting that I took. Nice. I'd like you to test the paint's magnetic orientation, please. Okay. Oh, yeah. You have no idea what this feels like, okay? Everything is numbers and logic to you. Just feel something for once. Senator, please. You've got to believe me. Within hours, everything within 30 degrees north and south of the equator is going to fall into complete darkness. The temperature is going to drop to a negative 273 degrees Celsius. That is absolute zero. Nothing will survive. Nothing! I guess it's true. Science is never wrong. That's right.